And as for our primaries, uh, we've got ourselves the Camouflage Corsage. Want to make a grand entrance? Entrance. Wow, I am not speaking well today. You'll be in the bell of the battlefield. Or we could get the Electron. Once this baby gets charged up, it's the end of the line for your enemies. This one I like a lot. But this one is Honey, and that's usually the conundrum I face. Do I want to stick with Honey? You know what? Screw it. We'll, uh, we'll get some push. Why not? Who cares? Now, mm, we gotta go and equip ourselves some upgrades here, starting with the Paladin Pulverizer, a beacon of virtuous butt kicking. I like that. I like that a lot. Much more than the big finish. Soundtrack to your enemy's destruction. It's the final countdown to their doom. Ooh, I do like the way that looks. But you know what? If we can stone someone, let's do it. And also for the ducky, we, oh, we already unlocked this one. That's kind of cute. Um, shoot. As mean and nasty as a villainous Koopa King, it was inspired by. Now it's your turn to breathe a little fire. It's like they're so weak. Oh, and then the, the Bowser Tail Jr., a direct descendant of the Bowser Tail, albeit more impulsive and with a higher pitched jumping sound. No, they're exactly the same. I don't know what you're smoking, game. So I don't. Hmm. I feel like I don't really use it all that much, but screw it. Let's go for it. Please and thank you. Uh, skip. And Luigi, what do you got for us? Lil Tyke's load and go. Just because you're in the thick of battle doesn't mean you can't have fun. Laugh and learn with the latest in precision weaponry for kids. That's amazing. Uh, but you know, I think I'll opt for this one. The Bag Sniper. Shut your opponent's gaggle and blow him a funeral dash with this played precision pipe. I did not commit to that and it showed. Uh, and then also we're definitely going for, ooh, the fatal frame looks so good. Oh man. And it's called Fatal Frame. Talk about being photobombed. That is such a high increase in everything. 85 damage? Holy smokes. All right, well, the Painville Express is where we're going. Pain Train delivers a payload of paroxysm to your antagonist right on schedule. Please and thank you. Uh, we're going to have enough for all of our friends, right? Uh, ooh, feel the heat. Give them a little love and love and a little oven lovin'. I love that. Uh, <laughs> all right. Uh, conk on the head with some stone damage. You know what? Ooh. Or we can get the bat out of heck. I do like me my vamp damage. Uh, you know what? Let's mix and match. Let's go for this. I do, I do like it. Uh, but on the other hand, we have... Oh, yeah. <laughs> the low rider. That's incredible. Um... Instead, oh, I love this, the Splatformer. Send your enemies to Minus World with this groundbreaking boom shot. The end. You know what, I'll take it. I will take your entire stock, please. And last but not least, I hope, uh, Peach. Hmm, don't know why I started going that way. Uh, rest assured, it's your foes that will turn yellow when you introduce them to your little friend. That's kind of cool. This one is pretty neat. Wow, the Kanagawa Pawa. Surfs up and Evil's about to take a gnarly wipeout as this top class wave hits the battlefield. You know, I've come to realize that I don't really care much for freezing with Peach, so let's go for the nasty yellow fella. And last but not least, oh, it's a little Kamek. Stranger things have happened in the Mushroom Kingdom. Actually, no, this is probably the strangest. That's adorable. Or we can get the Bob the Builder ass fire quacker. <laughs> That's amazing. I've never said that word out loud. Uh, you know what? It might be worth it just for this. Although, it does more damage against supporters. Yeah, we'll go for this. I do like, I do like the way this looks. It's good. Alright, we have enough for one more weapon if we want. I probably should have planned that out a little better, but, um... Yeah, that's all of our stuff done for here, so... Thank goodness for that. Um... All right, I hope you guys don't mind when I go through and read all of the like little descriptions because I think a lot of it is really clever writing like the fire quacker and things like that. And it's cute. I don't know, because it's a little bit of a lull in the action. So I was uh, kind of uh, wrestling with the prospect of actually physically going through the world and then hitting up the uh, stages like that, the ones that we haven't finished yet. Um, but I think we're just gonna use the washing machine. Um, since we already went to the world 
and collected all of the treasure, there's no reason to go back for a fourth time on its own to finish the last half of the missions. So I just figured this is going to be a more, well, I guess a less redundant way of doing things. So for those of you that missed it, uh, we went and did the first half of these challenges back when we finished off the first half of Spooky World 3. So now we're going to continue by uh, a little bit of chomp and circumstance. Uh, hopefully these aren't too painful. I know that the Ancient Garden ones were more difficult in relation to the rest of the game because you're so weak. Now that we have some good weaponry, I think we're more or less set. Now, unfortunately, we have one turn to destroy all of these enemies, and I'm... Don't like that. Uh, shoot. Well, for the most part, let's go and, uh, see what we have real quick. Uh, so, Sherbet Smasher... Actually, there's only, like, four enemies here. This guy's gonna die. You know, I'm actually not worried about this. Um, let's just go ahead and soup up our characters. I think I know that I do want... Rabid Mario, of course, but also Rabid Yoshi. And we're gonna need to screw up all of this stuff because I don't even know what I was thinking equipping what I did for that fight. It's just hoping it works out all right. So we're gonna go back to full here because I really enjoyed that. Make sure we're not useless there. Um, some hero sight. This is just gonna be part of the routine. We're not even gonna need that. Don't know why I equipped it. Go for some of this. And I think we're pretty much good with what I wanted. Uh, we'll go for some Mega Power. I'm not going to use it this turn. And you know what? We'll go for some of this. I did like having the coins fly to us, so we'll stick with that. And Cleansing Shot, why not? Now for M Rabid Mario. He's got some good stuff coming. I think I'll probably still stick with him having this completely uh, maxed out. We'll give him an extra dash. Uh, should we also give him some, yeah, we'll give him some movement. I noticed he's actually really nice for that sort of thing. And, uh, he probably could replace Luigi as a whole, you know? <laughs> Alright, so do we need a third dash? Sure, we have plenty. We'll go for some, well, we don't need no more health. Alright, magnet cooldown. This is only 50. This is just for later, I guess. Not that we need it now. Sure, why not? Why not pizza? All right, and last but not least, Rabbit Yoshi. There's only three enemies here, but I'm gonna go ahead and max out his damage also. That's gonna be nice. Mm, we'll put in an extra dash just for later. We'll have some of this. He's also really nice for movement as well. And then this stuff doesn't really bother me. I don't really care <laughs> for, you know, his outer shell or, you know, scaring things. But we'll give it a shot. We'll see what happens. Just a nice little cooldown. Uh, here, let's let's do this thing. <laughs> All right, we'll do that just so that we can be real nice. And he also has really low health, so we're fine. There we go. That's what we're going with here. Uh, just pure brute strength. And let's see what we need to do. Mario can't make it into the hole. Wonderful. All right. Uh, well. I guess this is a thing that's happening. I'm just gonna go and uh, hop on over here. Uh, is this a good idea? Should I, ooh, should I heal or do the thing with the M power first? Yeah, let's just go and take them all out. We'll do it all. All right, so I'm just gonna go and bash into you. Run over here and also have the cursor go away the hell over here. You know what, let's go right here. I would like to try to bait that one guy over here. So, and by that one guy, I mean this one. Yeah. You know, if I get that bounce, he's finished. That'd be funny. How's it going, friend? You're done. Thank you. Into the drink. How's it going? That actually looks really cool. It looks like it's under, like, the water is over ice right now. I don't know. It's kind of cool. All right, now Yoshi also can't make it. That's tragic. All right, well, uh, I guess we'll do the thing where we... What can you do? He can make it. We can also do this. Ooh, you know what? I should probably increase the range of that. That would be a nice thing for us to do, no? We can also do this. Hehehe. <laughs> Hehehe. <laughs> yeah, we'll go right here. 
Although, I just screwed uh, Yoshi, sadly. Um, sorry. Because <laughs> he can't reach the pipe. <laughs> That's fine. It's all fine. Ooh. That's nice. I like that. All right, well. That's all of them, right? Except for the guy that's gonna get chomped up. You know what? We'll we'll give Yoshi a bone here. We'll go and give the Bowser Tail Jr. a little bit of time in the sun. How's that sound? Get out of here. You're finished. And there we have it. Beautiful. <laughs> God, I love their their happy ass animations. So satisfying. All right, well that was a bit of chomp and circumstance. Do enjoy that. And something I was thinking about off screen is the fact that I probably will replay older chapters uh, just so that I can get extra coins because we're going to be real low on those. And, you know, I, I'm feeling like we are dangerously low on them. Uh, so now we have in the heart of the sherbet in the sherbet desert. Let's do it. I, I'm wondering if that's actually a reference to the Yes song in the Heart of the Sunrise, which would be kind of cool, but really random. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, weird. Oh, another one turn thing. Oh, no. Oh, no. You know what? These are regular ass smashers. What am I own knowing about? I think we're fine. There's just the four of them. We have one turn to do it. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh, this is gonna be real good. This is gonna be real nice. Rabbit Mario, step up to the plate, my friend. If there's ever been a time where your karaoke has taken you to the far reaches of, of vanity and professionalism, I'd like you to go ahead and just, you know, indulge us all with the song of your people. How's it going? Name's Allison Cruz. Uh, you all are finished. Just thought you should know. Uh, critical hit notwithstanding, but also much appreciated. Uh, and you know what? I'll let uh, Yoshi have a little bit of time in the sun. Why not? It's cold over here. And before we do anything else, let's grab all these coins. You know, speaking of which, there it is. All right. Uh, Yoshi. Or rabbit Yoshi. Uh, eat your heart out with the pulverizer. <laughs> Oh, that was tragic. I'm sorry. <laughs> Are we just going to be blazing through these now that we're not actually walking through the stages? <laughs> At this point, I think we're easily in the 60s of episodes. So hopefully you guys aren't getting too bored of it. But we have quite a bit to go. And if we want to do the Donkey Kong DLC, that's also going to be a bit of fun. I haven't finished it, but uh, maybe we'll just keep it that way, as we have the statue rendezvous. Okay, well, if you say so. Wait, which one is this? Statue rendezvous. Uh, oh, oh no. Oh no. Yikes. Um. Well. Is it? Oh, there's... Okay, so we're all separated, but there's only one place we need to get to. Okay, that seems easy enough. Uh, there are... Sherbet Smashers, and also Bucklers. I have a feeling we'll probably be fine. Just to be on the absolute safe side. Uh, that's probably all we're gonna get. Unless I put in Luigi and have him itchy feet his way through, but everyone's gonna attack him. So we're gonna have to brute force it. Ah, chocker. All right, so starting us off here, let's go ahead and move on into these guys, these wise guys. Uh, shoot, I can't move nearly as far as I thought I could. Uh, shoot, should we just hang out right here and then get there the next turn? That might be a good idea. Let's try that. Nice. All right, now for my next uh, trick, we're gonna go and scare everyone away because you guys are the worst. 